Hello friends and welcome to Vlogmas Day 23. I cannot believe that it is day 23 already. This has been the fastest going Vlogmas ever. The love that you guys have all shown it has been incredible. Steven and I were talking and I remember when I started out, if I got 100 views or 50 views on a Vlogmas video that first year, I was like blown away. Now every single video is over 10,000, which is like, shocking to me like absolutely shocking and it's all because of you and all the love and the support like you have no idea what it has meant for me to close out the year feeling that way i love you all it's been amazing um thank you for sharing and liking and giving thumbs up and just being a part of this with me Last night's vlog got to you guys really late, and that was really because I wanted to enjoy the evening, which I did, and not rush it, and just, um, yeah, just enjoy it. There are so few of those evenings anymore that I just really, really wanted to take the time to really connect, and it was needed. It is 8.12, I slept in till about seven, and now I just went through all the comments from last night's video, catching up on that stuff, catching up over on Instagram. If you're not following me on Instagram, where have you been? You've been sleeping. Um, follow me over on Instagram, we have a lot of fun over there. I plan on doing a lot of things on Instagram in 2021, which I'm excited about. There's gonna be a lot more stories, a lot more highlights, a lot more DIYs happening over there, so please make sure that you're over there following me as well. Today, I don't know, I don't have any plans. Someone was joking in the comments, they're like, I can't believe how much you get done in a day. To me, I feel like I don't get enough done, but I guess to others, it's a lot of things. Yesterday was a jam-packed day, and I still feel like there were things I could have done and should have done. So I don't really have a plan for the next two days. We're just gonna see where it goes and what comes up and what we end up doing. But right now, I'm going to go ahead and set up a simmer pot for the day. All right, friends, I am literally just going to use some things I have around the house that I need to use up anyway. So I am going to do some rosemary, some orange slices, grapefruit slice or two. Some apple, some pine. I also have a package of mulling spices I'm going to add. And I'm just gonna let that simmer on low today and make the house smell beautiful. A lot of you make comments around putting the simmer pot on the stove and letting like your burner on low and let it simmer all day. I don't do that because of our house. What I don't think I've ever shared with you guys is our house is actually a really eco-friendly home. Our heating and cooling system runs off of what they call a geothermal system. So we literally have coils that run through the ground and our heating and cooling is done by groundwater. And it's a really eco-friendly way. It's a huge investment up front but truly it does pay for itself. So I don't have natural gas heating and cooling running through my home. So like to use my stovetop, like it's not using natural gas. We end up using propane, which is a much cleaner gas to burn. And that operates my stove and my fireplace. So we fill it up once a year. So that's why I don't use my stovetop because I, it would be a waste of our propane to run it like all day long. Although I don't know how much it would actually waste. I just, mm, I'll stick with my little crock pot. I've actually been doing really well. Sadly, there's still something I'm waiting for for my Christmas tradition. I'm hoping it's supposed to arrive today. Fingers crossed, but shipping has been a little messy. I'm all caught up. I actually checked, started to check this one off because I did that yesterday when I was at Target. I actually bought the lady Starbucks that was behind me. I've already checked in on someone. We took all of the scrap vegetables we had up into the woods. 
I give a gift card. Done, done, done. So I'm in a really, really good spot. I'm excited. I might actually get a jump on this one today, setting goals for 2021. Emma and Rachel still loving all my fridge decor that you sent. Speaking of decor, the verdict is in. I will be doing a transitional video of Christmas decor to winter decor. So that will be on its way. All right, I'm gonna make another cup of coffee and just rest for a minute. Sometimes I do rest. <gasps> Good morning, sunshine. You and daddy slept late. You were sleeping in. I snuck down here. Good morning. Do you have to go outside? Yes, I know. Oh, good morning sneezes. Go do business. <gasps> good morning. It's a good morning cookie. There you go. Oh, that dog, I love him so much. One thing that came yesterday that I didn't really get a chance to share because yesterday was just such a busy day are my Anna Heinmark stickers I ordered for my planner. Hey, the packaging is really cute. So, they arrived. And like I told you all, I got a two and a one to mark this year's planner. Look, I like customized my Ink and Volt planner and I'm really happy with that. So, I'm totally owning it. It's a little after 11. I'm still in my pajamas and robe. And that is a-okay. I uh, watched, uh, I don't know how she does it with Sarah Jessica Parker. It's one of my favorite movies. To me, it's a Christmas movie. I love it. And it's just, I don't know, it's just like a feel-good movie and I love the cast in it. And now I'm just like sweeping floors and cleaning up some pine needles from last night because I didn't run like a really deep sweep. So just doing that, sweeping all my hardwoods, just cleaning up and dusting and just making sure the house is tidy for tomorrow and Christmas day and just doing all those things. Nothing too exciting. I'm really just gonna take it easy today. I promise we'll get into something though. And the road I take and looks real good now. Time flies, messy as the mud on your truck ties. Now I'm missing your smile, hear me out. It is going on four o'clock and I totally am in my pajamas. Today, I literally didn't do anything. I have been so busy doing so much around the house, doing so much baking and so much cooking that today I just unapologetically took time for me. I did do some planning in my new Ink and Volt planner, really thinking about goals for next year and reflecting on what I want to accomplish and what are going to be some of my areas of focus. And I literally just chilled. I watched a movie today, I read, I talked to Steven a lot, I listened to music. I just took time for me, which I think is beautiful going into the holiday and yeah, it's awesome. I'm now prepping dinner, just so I'm ahead of that. I thought out some chicken breast. I'm gonna make like a stir fry tonight with some veggies that I need to use up anyway. So I cut up some broccoli, some peppers, some carrots. I'm listening to Taylor Swift's Evermore album, which I love. I think the music is gorgeous and so well written. I'm gonna make an easy peanut sauce to go with the stir fry tonight. Um, yeah, I do have to get out my pajamas, so I'm gonna go do like a quick 30, 40 minute workout, shower, clean up, and then I'll come and probably finish prepping dinner. All right, friends, I am going to go ahead and make my stir fry sauce that I make all the time. There are no measurements, so I just think you do it to taste. So I'm going to start, I'm gonna start with two 
spoonfuls of crunchy peanut butter. I always use crunchy for my, actually I have a lot of vegetables. So I'm gonna do three. What I have done with this, if I make too much sauce, I'll just store it and use it as like a salad dressing. But with as much vegetables as I have, I'm gonna do, make a little bit more than maybe I normally would. I do have some hot water with me. That's just for thinning out in case I need to. Um, I'm gonna add probably like a spoonful of brown sugar. I'm gonna put a healthy splash of soy sauce. I'm also going to put a splash of sesame oil. Not a lot, sesame oil is very strong. And we like things spicy. So a couple shakes of red chili pepper flakes. Oh, the smell of this is so amazing. And now I'm just gonna add just a little bit of water just to get this thinned out. I just took my pan off the heat. Um, I'm not ready to make all of dinner yet, but I just got some nice browning on the chicken, so that's all taken care of. I'll cook my vegetables, throw my chicken back in, throw the sauce in, let the chicken kind of finish cooking. Bubba's just came down from upstairs. He was taking a nap. He's taking a nap. Yes, you were. You want a cookie? And then I'm gonna go open advent calendars. I truly can't believe it's day 23. There's only one more. Oh, it's a little sled with gifts. It is a goat milk hand and body wash. I feel like we've received that already. Oh, it's a uh, roll-on oil. And it is the sleep roll-on oil. It's the temple oil. Super pumped about that. All right. Pour some sugar on me. Oh, the butterfly gummies. These are really, really good. Aww. It's a really cute wreath and then this little gold heart. Super cute. Do you want your advent calendar? Do you want your advent calendar? Do you? Do you want your advent calendar? Do you want it? Okay, we'll have it. Let's see. Let's, do you want to give it to him? Yes. He's all caught up. Whoopers. <gasps> you have one more day left. Uh, his might be 25. Uh, oh my. I was crouching so long installing that sink yesterday <laughs> that my legs are sore. That's when you know you're old. Uh, and you are old. You missed one. You missed 14. Wait, did he open 20? Um, right here. No, he didn't open 20. Bubby, how are you so many days behind? Well, we're not giving you all these cookies. He didn't open 22 either. And 14? How did we miss 14? Those will be after Christmas. Oh no, Bubby. Christmas I'm making you one of your favorite dinners. Oh, chicken, oh, peanut, chicken stir fry? Yes. Oh, thank you. You'll have to make your famous rice. Oh my god, I'm going to get my pot out. Let me get my bat and I get a little bag of rice. <laughs> um, I took it out of the bag. So, where is it? It's in the container. What, uh, where? The pasta containers. There's a whole container of rice. This won't do because the instructions for my famous rice recipe were on the bag. <laughs> so you don't to... know how to do it? Look at this. It's okay, it's cute. Wait, you're, you only knew your rice recipe from the bag? I thought you, I thought it was, you knew it by heart. I can't believe that you threw out the bag. But you know how I like everything in the pantry container. So do you know how to make your rice? Try. Let's see, it might, it's, it might get a little dicey here. Do you want to Google it? No. What are I, you? I remember how to. Want, want this on here. But you're not using that burner, so. I don't know which burner. That the, the rice didn't get hot enough with that little burner. Okay. <sighs> well, I think you have some time. You don't have to make the rice right now. Yeah, it's not. It's a little early. Tea time with Steven. 
Alright, 20. Ooh, he spills the tea. You know where I spilled the tea? Uh, the park today. When uh, I was on Sally Jesse Raphael in the 80s. And then I also was on Ricky Lake. I, I was a producer. Oh, God. No wonder there was so much trash on TV. What's daddy opening? What is this? Slay ride. I slay all day. Okay, point we missed yesterday. Bobby, what is this? What is it? Valerian Nights. That was my long program in Sarajevo. I don't know. No, why. you skated to Carmen, remember? He loves Bizet. We <laughs> love you. Who's a wound up? Who's a wound up boy? Oh yes, oh yes, I love you. How'd your rice turn out? Good, it's still. Ooh. And this is gonna be our night. I'm just going to basically cook these vegetables till they're tender, throw the chicken back in, throw in the sauce, let it cook and simmer a little bit, and that will be dinner. And I think this is gonna conclude Vlogmas Day 23. Be kind to yourself, be kind to others, and remember, kindness is free. Give it to everyone and anyone. Until next time, which will be tomorrow, goodbye.